guys what is up this most William here thank you for watching this video and welcome back again to my channel m design strategies and in this video I will show you how you can design this smart cycling web app design in Figma so my apologies that uh, I didn't be able to post uh, videos uh, of my channel in previous days so my apologies for this because I was busy some other stuff and right now I'm back with uh, another tutorial videos and i will also create more videos related to this topic so watch this video till the end also uh, if you haven't subscribed to my youtube channel please go and subscribe so let's get started with this tutorial okay so here i show you how you can create this you know uh, this uh, website design in figma so what we will do first we will uh, first we have to take a new artboard new frame right for that so again go to this above uh, tools and you can select the frames now select the sizes accordingly you can select uh, uh, 1400 this desktop size which is always be good for your website design right so your web app design so make sure that you selected this and now uh -huh now we have to first of all make the background pure black right pure black background we need and uh, let me just show you how you can do this so let me just copy my logo uh, then i will show you how you can do this so uh, like layout grid it's always good you know if you uh, make it in the layout in columns rows right so make sure that it's 12 uh, columns right and now we have to just cut this paste your logo here. and now little bit we have to adjust the layout margins and width right margins we have to adjust okay so this is 84 margin it's good now adjust your logo here accordingly and here we have to again uh, create a circle so uh, create this circle like this make it inside the artboard and uh, make it center a little bit to uh, reduce the width now make it uh, yellow according to your uh, color your theme color right once you done this with once you're done with this now you have to go to iconify quickly we'll go to iconify and search for menu icon and you will find there are multiple menus for multiple latest menu designs right so <coughs> you can get anyone from this so I already have so let me just copy my menu you can download it right just for showing you quickly i'm just pasting it here right okay once you're just with this now we have to create buttons and icons again you can go to iconify and search for search icon and basket icon right so i already have okay and now we will paste it here and now again we have to create the buttons the button right so create the button like this inside the columns within the columns right don't go beyond the columns because it's always be good for when you are, when you are designing anything it should be always good for developers as well make sure that it should be under this column right and now just uh, give stock remove the fill give this border black it's right now it's black so we will make it yellow reduce the thickness right and now right here order now text suppose text you can uh, you can click on this text and right here order now select the font accordingly so right now i have selected lexandica font which is really very also good 
popular right so make it like this now like your button and uh, your other icons logo okay so now we have to create uh, we have to you know create a line in <coughs> below this below the stuff we have created below the navigation bar so make sure that it's all it's properly aligned right sometimes you know it goes down or you just have to adjust it yourself here manually If you confuse in this you can just uh, hide the layout for now like this and right now it seems very black so make it dark or you can yeah now it's okay make the stock light very light like this now we have to again select the font and write the font here smart cycling <coughs> sorry select the font right here smart cycling so the font i have selected for this let me just check out uh, this is lucita and make your font bigger and make it uppercase letter uppercase words make it bold now again uh, unhide your layout grid and adjust your font here under the under this layout grid right okay and font size should be 45 or 46 like this right right here cycling Once you write this now change the color to this yellow color right and for image you have to you can go you can go and search for the images right so you can uh, check out on chrome go to chrome and just search here smart cycling and you will find there are multiple transparent cycling images from where you can get it easily right and you can also search on freebie and other main websites right so i'm just for now i'm just copying this uh, image here from a file right and accordingly you can adjust your font size i think it's a little bit bigger make it 36 around 36 right and this style for style you can make it like this or you want another style you can just simply make it like this so it's always you know it's all upon you what you want and what what you do what you wish to do right whatever you like you can make it accordingly right <coughs> so for now i'm just keeping it again the same as i showed you previously and here how i created the circle just uh, I copied this image image here and uh, I just cropped it you can also do the, this but make sure that it should be adjusted always right because right now it's uh, looking a little bit odd right and weird so I just hide this uh, below image okay 
so when i create all the whole the whole website and i will uh, create it more better right it's all the design thing that i have used here <coughs> make your cycle a little bit more down and also give drop shadow to your fonts like this okay and now we have to write here another text okay and also we have to create some shapes let me show you this gives much effect and you know usually it looks better if you keep this kind of shapes here something like this okay make this make this backward right make it backward now you can duplicate this or create another Just play with these shapes right you can play with these shapes according to your perspective according to your desire right and your creativity i also you know always play with the designs and uh, make ex experiments how it will look better and we which shapes is always be better for this website design and when I create some kind of you know weekly interactions right so here when once you're done with this now we have to uh, create a circle and we have to show the detail of this cycle like on the tires what are the stuff what type of tires it is right so <coughs> create this the circle create make it white again duplicate you this circle make it a bit more bigger right um, go to this stock and uh, remove this fill sorry for this disturbance if you are uh, hearing any sound of barking dogs right so sorry for that because i'm just creating this video at night you can make it yellow as well but it should be white right because it's not active make it here let's put even here or wherever you are seeing some kind of feature of this cycle like this I'm just copying the text from my file because I already have this right for showing you quickly everything because uh, if I won't copy this then <laughs> this video will go much longer for you and you will lose interest to in this in doing the full video right so I'm just showing you everything quickly here change this color Mm, like this okay and now we have to write smart side so the backward of this tire here future uh, and make this very very light like this and it should be condensed extra bold right okay so 
that's how you can create this web design website design in figma and i haven't created the full video of this uh, website so soon i will create more uh, more lessons of this feed of this website right so thank you for watching this video i hope i have explained you everything in effective way and hope you enjoy this so if you really like this then please hit the thumbs up also uh, subscribe to my youtube channel if you haven't subscribed yet like this video share this video with your friends and keep going thank you so much for watching this video